Hey guys, it's Hans Hobbies, and uh, in this video, I just want to discuss like some body options for these 128 scale uh, team associated like micro cars. Uh, sorry about the cardboard in the back. There's it's a mess of wires behind that, so I thought better have a little backdrop rather than have you guys look at a bunch of wires. But um, this is obviously, as you can see, the team associated RC28 uh, RC10 replica buggy. Um, and I found something pretty interesting about it. So, be being hobby grade, all the bodies are Lexan or PVC, whatever they are, uh, and they're removable. And it opens up uh, some body options. So, they do sell clear versions of all the different bodies. They have, <clears throat> sorry, they have a monster truck version. They have a short course truck version. They have a retro stadi stadium truck version. And they have this re retro buggy version. And all the different versions come with, uh, not they don't come with. You can, you can buy the clear bodies for about $15. So if you don't like the color scheme of the, bug, uh, the car you got or the truck you got, then you can easily buy a body, paint it up, um, being so small, it won't even take a can of paint. Um, paint it up and you'll have a pretty cool little custom paint job buggy or truck or whatever you have. And you can also probably make the windows clear if you want to because these are sticker windows. Um, but if you want some other options, I found a pretty interesting uh, option. For especially if you're into more scale looking vehicles. So over here we have just this is just a new bright um new bright RC truck. It's a 124th scale truck. This is the box that it comes in. It's just a really basic art uh truck. You can get these at Walmart, Target, wherever you grocery shop. Um you can get them for around ten dollars. They're really cheap. Um, and as a RC car, um, it works pretty well. It takes, it runs on three double A's, but it's pretty peppy for what it is. Um, got plenty of torque. So, it's pretty fun to play with by itself. But what's interesting about it are these nice bodies that it comes with. So some of the bodies that they offer look a little cheaper um, than some of the other ones. I know this uh, F-250 version and the F-150 version look pretty cool. They have a couple um, uh, concept Bronco versions. Um, those look pretty nice. The ones that I wasn't very f uh, fond of was the Ram version and the, the, the Colorado version. Those uh, aren't very detailed and the plastic looks very cheap. Um, those aren't painted. You can see this is painted. And a pretty nice candy red, like metallic red color. It's got a full depth bed, which is also cool. Um, and you can tell it's painted because on this one, they got a bit of hair. Feel focus. It's got a bit of hair stuck. That's not on the surface. It's got a bit of hair stuck in the paint, which is pretty unfortunate. But I'll probably paint this a uh, different color anyway, so it doesn't really matter. So the main reason I got it, obviously, it wasn't just to have the new bright RC cars, just so I could steal the body off of it. And if we see, um, there's a bunch of cat hair under here. But if we take the body off of this, and it only it's only held on with two screws. So it's just two Phillips heads. This one in the front. And one in the back. So I won't be able to put it straight on the car because it's post. So you can see uh, it's nicely painted. It's a pretty nice looking body too. And what's interesting about it is, if you can see, it's the exact same wheelbase as these 128 scale cars. And I think that opens up a lot of custom options. Um, I, this only applies to, as far as I'm aware, to the 
buggy version and the stadium truck version because from what I've seen, it looks like the short course truck version and the monster truck version have a slightly longer wheelbase. Um, if I'm wrong, uh, please let me know in the comments. But uh, from what I've seen from all the reviews and the comparisons I've seen, um, that seems to be the case. I don't have the short course truck version, so I can't I can't say that for sure. But um, that's what it uh, that's what it looked like from what I've seen of other people's videos. But for these buggy versions, um, you can see if you can ignore the buggy underneath. That looks pretty nice. That, that fits pretty well. Obviously, when the wheel the the body's centered, the wheel's gonna poke out a little bit, but you know, I don't think that's a huge deal. Probably wouldn't be that hard to make like little fender flares for this thing, or even just leave it looking kind of like poked out like that. Um, I think that that looks pretty nice. So that's probably an, a, a path I might go. Not with this one in particular, because I, I do like the buggy body on this. But if I ever happen to pick up another one, Definitely, this would be an option. Um, uh, what I'm thinking about is actually picking up another one of these and um, converting it with this truck body and then making a little tow rig for the buggy because the buggy obviously looks race uh, race car look and um, this is obviously more of like a, a lot of people use these uh, Super Duty trucks to tow their race cars and um, their uh, Jeeps and stuff. So I think that would look pretty nice. Just imagine this truck towing this little race buggy. I think that would look really cool and be a lot of fun to play with. So um, that's just like a quick little video for you guys. Uh, if you guys end up doing it uh, before me, uh, let me know. And if you have a video of it, include the link in the in the comments because I'd love to see it. Um, I'd love to see how, how people come up with ways to mount the body. So yeah, uh, I hope that give you, gives you guys some ideas, um, like some project ideas. So uh, I'm, I'm pretty excited about it too. So thanks for watching. Uh, if you like the video, uh, hit like, hit thumbs up. Uh, if you like my content, um, subscribe. And I'll have a lot more RC and other model kit related videos coming up very soon. And uh, yeah, uh, thanks for watching again and uh, have a nice day.